My name is Alex McKechnie, and I'm Director of Sports Science slash Assistant Coach for the Toronto Raptors Basketball Club. There's only 30 jobs in the world, and only one of one in Canada. It's my role in this world to put my athletes in the best possible environment to succeed. You have to control what you can't control. You can't control trauma. Trauma will happen, but you can mitigate some of the damages. <laughs> when the whistle blows on first day of training camp, there are no days off. We play 82 games in five and a half months in three separate time zones. When the season starts, it's really all about recovery and how you manage to recover and prepare for the next game. Those decisions are not always the best for the coaching staff or for the management but they're ultimately the best decision for the player, and that's all that matters to me and my staff. There are only 450 players in the world playing the NBA. They're all good. The ones that don't make it are good. When we talk about feeding our players, we don't want to put bad fuel in the Ferrari. We're tinkering with them every single day and making sure every cylinder's firing. There's a lot of pressure. Some people often say to me, you know, you're on the bench, why are you so serious? Well, there's a lot of money out there tonight. I'm working when I'm on the bench. We're watching, we're trailing, we're looking at what's happening. The responsibility is big. Do I feel it? I don't ignore it, that's for sure. I respect it. I grew up in Scotland, grew up in Glasgow, and it was my goal to play professional soccer at that point. I couldn't get there, and I was exposed to physiotherapy at a very young age, at 15 years old. If I couldn't be a player, I was going to be the best possible therapist I could be. That was it. My only goal was to work in professional sport. I didn't see myself going in any other direction, quite honest with you. A very famous player got injured in Los Angeles by the name of Shaquille O'Neal. The Lakers at that time contacted myself and asked if we would assess it, which we did, and of course, uh, the rest is history, really. We're fortunate enough to be able to work with various different athletes and different players from NBA, NFL, the NHL. When I think of the journey, it's been incredible, but it's not without a sacrifice, and it's the people that have sacrificed for me, which is my family. We're all pretty blessed to work in the NBA. I've been fortunate enough four decades later to be still within the business and working in the highest level we can work at at this point. You don't get a career, you build a career, and it takes many years to do that.